In your conventional Hollywood film, its structure can go like this. Introduction, rising action, climax, falling action, conclusion. Editors Paul Hirsch, Marsha Lucas, and Richard Chu famously used this idea to restructure its scenes within the edit to make sense of what Lucas wanted to tell with his space fantasy epic and simplified process. But when Spielberg took on the task of West Side Story, he had a different problem. How do you tell a new story with what's been given in 1961? In the original film, we have these three vital scenes take place in different parts of the film. I feel pretty often feels left out as it enters into the rumble, but does work instead after an act break, providing levity before getting heavier as the rumble and cool come in. However, we should emphasize that this entire sequence is interrupted by cool, which is not connected to Tony and Maria within the aforementioned three vital scenes, placing emphasis instead on the overall effect of Bernardo's death. The overall effect of this entire sequence of scenes becomes shock after shock, a what could go wrong until its finale, creating a larger effect of an unceasingly cruel world after its optimistic opening half. This is of course founded by its pooling from the original Shakespearean text of Romeo and Juliet, thus tying one hand behind its back by following the original story. However, 2021 has no qualms over the original Shakespearean tale, instead pulling from the stage musical itself, along with that original film. Now, the scene plays like this. The rumble, I feel pretty, somewhere, a boy like that. The choice to have I feel pretty take place after the rumble makes the scene have a more tragic undertone as Maria doesn't realize that Tony has killed her own brother, along with a more streamlined emotional feel as each scene stacks on one another intention, emotion, and thematic exploration. It's a simple choice by screenwriter Tony Kushner and director Steven Spielberg that emphasizes what the combination of scenes is all about, the tragedy and regret of Maria's life as it spirals downward emphasized by the Greek choir of Valentina as she shows what could have been. In 1961, it's a Shakespearean epic with big ideas, having a wider view of not just its title characters, but the world around them. In 2021, it places a laser-sharp focus on its characters. Thus, we begin to see what Spielberg changed in his version, along with what each add to the same story, just by their placement of scenes, allowing the crew of 2021 to create new meaning and angles for what that story says, and place a greater emphasis on how to make previous scenes better than they were before.